Still coming up on our Feel Good Breakfast show, I must say I'm totally inspired because we're talking about colouring in. Now, there's a reason why when in a restaurant they give children a bundle of crayons and then, well, the menu is basically an illustration that you can colour in. Now, whether inside or outside the lines, colouring in can keep a busy child and get them really settled. And apparently, it's the same for adults. Art therapy is widely practiced by psychiatrists, crisis centers, and in other situations where mental and emotional health are of greatest importance. Cornell Pistorius, manager of a fetal specialist practice, has a pilot program in a local maternity ward. There's a lot of power in art therapy, and especially color in is a form that they can do in the bed in hospital. Most patients need to stay here for quite a while, and if their minds are occupied, it really helps them not to get in a hurry to get home. Adult coloring books are different than children's books in the sense that they've got very complicated patterns. Some of the books are just intricate, small areas to color in. They are appealing because I think even for adults, we're yearning back to our childhood years, but it's also you creating something, you know, just not playing a game with no end result. Coloring books for adults feature mandalas, a concentric structure usually dominated by squares or triangles which offer balancing visual elements. Along with intricate designs and swirling paisleys, colouring is de-stressing and generates quietness within the busy adult mind. The first reaction of patients when we give them the colouring book is sort of surprised. But as soon as they get involved in that, they really ask for more. So we donate the books to the labour ward and all the ladies want to colour in books. I think it gives themselves a memory to the time they've been there. The design of these adult colouring books has to be visually appealing to occupy the mind in a way that chattering thoughts cease. It allows our creative side to be a little more free, while our analytical side can take a rest, a necessary mental balance for expectant mothers under stress. My water broke on 18 weeks, so I'm on bed rest now until they, they try and hope that the baby makes his uh, own water, yeah. Since I've been in hospital, my mind is constantly and obviously on the baby and worrying about is everything going to be fine. Last year, also on 18 weeks, we lost a baby boy. And obviously you lie and you ask God questions and you don't know why you must go through this again. And I was just hanging on on Proverbs 3 verse 5, which says, trust the Lord with all your heart and do not lean on your own understanding. And that's basically what I'm doing here. Friends gave me books. I'm not a reader at all. And I started a bit reading, but it wasn't me. If I catch myself again, I will like think of something else. And then when she brought in this book, it took my mind immediately off whatever is going on. While I'm drawing, I listen to music, which helps a lot. And the music calms me down. And the fact that the detail in the patterns are so tiny and you have to concentrate, just by concentrating, already my mind is off whatever is going on in the hospital. Seven of the 10 best selling books on a leading online shopping site are coloring books for adults. So it's no wonder more institutions are adopting art therapy in practice. It allows us to release our worries and go back to childhood, a simpler time when the world was simply filled with happy colors. Well, lovely colours indeed. Adults are so intrigued with this notion of colouring in that apparently publishers can't keep up with the demand. Well, talking about colouring in and the art of that is musician Lisa Bietman is joining us in our studio this morning. Welcome to the show. Thank you, Elaine. Well, now you're an artist as well. And I must say, art therapy is probably not about the end result. It's going to be the journey itself. How come you have to be in Mandala's art in the beginning? You know, this is where my path has come. I've been intuitive. In een tijd in mijn leven, uh, in mijn leven waar ik het groot verlies en hard en trauma um, leef. En ik was niet op een goede plek. Nie. En dit is opgedaag in mijn leven. Ik heb het vanzelf begin teken, ik heb het voor zes maanden getekend voor ik geleerd het van die woord mandala. Ik heb het niet geweerd het bestaan. Nie. Well, now mandala art, I mean, I didn't know it's called mandala either. Um, she explained to me that mandala means circular, so it, it refers to a circle, and then uh, this beautiful art, which is almost a mosaic type, uh, gets developed and we can color it in. It's widely recognized as a, as a reflection of its creator almost. I mean, I'm, I'm interested in how you came up with these intricate designs. Where come you from, Svendan? I also don't know. I don't know, because... Rechtig, as ik het teken, begin mm. ik in die middel. Wow. Um, en dit vloei naar buiten soos dit wil. Um, dit is niet iets wat ik vooraf uitdenk of beplan nie. 
Maar jij zijn kunstenaar, so jij zegt van mij, jij jij begint het teken en het hou niet aan en dan begin jij een vorm te krijgen met mensen kan en keer zelfs goed met mensen. Oh ja. En ik denk mensen, gelukkig genieten die mensen het bij om in mandalas in de kleren. Ik denk dat ze uh, vrijheid. Mm. Dat een mensen is maar geconditioneerd jong. Als dat een boom in die prinkje is, dan wil hij groen en bruin wees mm. en is dat. Maar met die mandalas, um, je weet je is bij meer vrijheid met kleren denk ik. Wat, uh, en mensen gaan niet dat het nodig dat vrijheid. Maar moet ook nog levens worden dus ingeperk op beide manieren. Als je wonder hoe kom Lisa ze worden amper soos lyrieke klink. Zij is eigenlijk muzikant en zij wil leven ook of een live kunstenaar met die boeken die mandalas. Hoe kom een inkleerboek voor groot mensen? Weet je, hier was bloote antwoord op een vraag. Um, ek het baie mense het vir my geskryf, um, gevra oor die mandalas, vir hoop gevra, mm-hmm. wat self dier um, moeilike omstandighede gaan. En ek het al meer gekry dat mense gevra het, sal ek nie asjeblief mandalas teken wat hulle kan inkleer nie. Mm-hmm. As hulle self sê kom met die teken, dit kom nie mm-hmm. vir allemaal natuurlijk die teken nie. Mm-hmm. Um, so ek het bloot geantwoord op die vraag, um, en nou kan hulle inkleer. En nou kan hulle inkleer. Mm. Currently, VC has recognized Lisa's books and have literally rated it as number one and even on the top ten list of coloring books. And as I mentioned, the demand is, is crazy. The appeal, hoe kom hou mense daarvan om in te kleer as groot mense? Kijk, ek dink, elke individu krij daar uit wat het vir hom is. En ek dink nie, dit is noodwendig vir allemaal die self te neem. En vir partij is het bloot vreugde, vir ander bring dit kalmte en rustigheid, troos. Um, so dit kan een verskynheid van dinge wees, maar ek dink, die m- ding wat die meeste oorkoepelend is, is dat mens is moe gejaag. Mm, en wie alles, stil vertuik en nie ja, poos. Ja, oh, oh, is so dit vir, alles is het vir 10 minute, mm. ne? net bykie stil raak en op een ding focus in plaas van 80 goed gelijk. Maar jy is nou my sekant, wat gebeur volgende? Vinnig. Jy nou, die lijst is al so lang, ek nek om nou op, okay. <laughs> om nog een tijd te volgen. Lees een week, man, in ons atelier, haar nieuwe boek, wat sy ook nou uitbring, gaan jy vir ons muziek maak later? Ek gaan later. Ok, so sy het haar kitaar ook gebring, ons is heel beindrukt met jou project, baie geluk. Baie dank. Ja, ons gaan definitief, kan ek een huis toe vat? Ja, ek het veel gebring, te sê. Ha, present, dankie. <laughs>